Hollywood elites have come out, and they are fuming. Today we're diving deep into a topic that's been causing quite a stir in Tinseltown. We're talking about Mel Gibson's explosive revelations in the film Sound of Freedom and the alleged involvement of Hollywood's elite in some seriously scandalous activities. Buckle up, because this is going to be a wild ride. Remember to leave a like on this video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching. Let's dive in. Despite having a star-studded cast and crew, Alejandro Gomez Monteverdi's film Sound of Freedom has managed to remain obscure. The movie delves into the shadowy world of unlawful human trafficking, exposing alarming techniques used by the privileged to ensnare unsuspecting people in their evil networks. You might be asking why there hasn't been much hype, press coverage, or support for this significant movie. Why isn't a movie with a well-known actor, a well-known director, and advertising from none other than Mel Gibson himself being screened in theaters? It would appear that the film's message has caused some strong ruffling among the feathers. The movie gives the impression that some of the most powerful persons in Hollywood may have been involved in these kinds of illegal actions. And one person whose name has been dragged into the center of it all is none other than the legendary Oprah Winfrey herself. Online chatter has been rampant with accusations against Oprah. Some netizens claim that she has used her influential talk show as a platform to identify and groom potential victims under the guise of offering them opportunities for success. People all over threads online are also saying that Oprah's silence on the matter is just making the situation worse and only dampening her image as people speculate if she is guilty or not. What do you think about these allegations? Do you believe there could be any truth to them or do you think they are unfounded? However, it is not just Oprah who is said to be implicated in this scandal. It has been suggested that other prominent figures such as Jamie Foxx and Dwayne The Rock Johnson are involved in this affair as well. It has been stated that the most powerful and influential people in Hollywood are highly terrified and confused about what steps to take next. The discoveries have caused shockwaves to spread across the sector, and as a result, many of the most powerful players in the industry are currently in a state of fear. Even Dwayne The Rock Johnson hasn't been spared. Accusers online suggest that his global charity work is a front for these scandalous activities, alleging that he uses his philanthropic trips to identify potential victims in vulnerable communities. Dwayne The Rock Johnson has reacted angrily and with astonishment to the claims that have been made against him. He has been very public about his frustration, and he has emphatically denied being involved in any actions of this nature. However, the question that needs to be answered is why these claims are coming to light now and what the implications of that are for the future of Hollywood. Dwayne has allegedly reported with anger in a recent taken down tweet as well as disbelief to these allegations. These accusations are not only false, but they're also deeply offensive. I've dedicated my career to entertaining people and making the world a better place not to engaging in the horrific activities this film suggests. I categorically deny any involvement in such activities and will fight these allegations with everything I've got, responded The Rock regarding the backlash about the movie and all the hate he's been getting online recently. The Rock not only refutes the charges, but he takes serious offense to the fact that they were even suggested. He clearly denies any involvement in such heinous crimes, while emphasizing his dedication to entertaining people and making the world a better place. He also indicates that he is willing to defend himself against these claims using every resource he's got. But the question remains, is this response enough? Given the severity of the allegations and the influence that The Rock has, should he be doing more? Should he be using his platform to raise awareness about human trafficking, to support victims, and to advocate for stricter laws and enforcement? Now you might be wondering, why did Mel Gibson decide to promote Sound of Freedom when he could be putting himself in such hot water with his Hollywood peers? While we can't speak for Gibson himself, we can make some educated guesses based on the film's content and Gibson's past. Mel Gibson is a figure who has never shielded away from controversy. Throughout his career, he has shown a willingness to confront difficult and often uncomfortable subjects. His directorial ventures from Braveheart to The Passion of the Christ have tackled themes of oppression, sacrifice, and the struggle for freedom. These films have not only entertained audiences, but also sparked conversations about history, faith, and human rights. 
Sound of Freedom falls squarely within this tradition. The film delves into the dark world of human trafficking, a global issue that affects millions of people but is often overlooked in mainstream cinema. By promoting this film, Gibson is once again using his platform to bring attention to a pressing issue, much as he has done throughout his career. Mel Gibson's cinematic portfolio is testament to his enduring fascination with narratives that revolve around true stories of heroism, resilience, and the indomitable human spirit. His filmography is replete with tales of individuals who, against all odds, have demonstrated extraordinary courage and tenacity in the face of adversity. Sound of Freedom is a prime example of this thematic preference. The film brings to life the inspiring and heart-wrenching story of Tim Ballard, a former government agent who made the audacious decision to leave the security of his job to embark on a perilous mission. Ballard dedicated his life to the noble cause of rescuing children ensnared in the horrifying web of human trafficking, risking everything in the process. This narrative is not just a tale of heroism, but also one of profound sacrifice and resilience. Ballard's journey is fraught with danger and uncertainty, yet his unwavering commitment to his mission propels him forward. His story is a testament to the power of human will and the lengths to which one can go when driven by a purpose greater than oneself. This narrative of courage in the face of unimaginable horror aligns seamlessly with the themes that Gibson has explored in his previous work. From the battlefields of Braveheart to the spiritual struggles and the passion of the Christ, Gibson has consistently delved into stories. That showcase the strength of the human spirit when confronted with seemingly insurmountable challenges. In Sound of Freedom, Gibson continues this tradition, shedding light on a dark corner of our world and highlighting the heroic efforts of those fighting against it. The film serves as a poignant reminder of the real world, horrors that persist, and the extraordinary individuals who dedicate their lives to combating them. It's a narrative that not only resonates with Gibson's previous work, but also underscores his commitment to telling stories of real-life heroes and their unwavering resilience. But there's another layer to consider. The film suggests that some of Hollywood's elite are involved in these illicit activities. Given Gibson's often fraught relationship with Hollywood, it's possible that he sees Sound of Freedom as a way to challenge the industry and provoke a conversation about its power dynamics. However, keep in mind that these are merely speculations. Take them with a grain of salt. The only person who can really explain Mel Gibson's reasons for pushing Sound of Freedom is Mel Gibson himself. We encourage you, the viewers, to think about these topics, but we also invite you to conduct your own research and come to your own conclusions. As we conclude our comprehensive exploration into the film Sound of Freedom, it's clear we've delved deep into its unsettling revelations and the ensuing debates it has sparked. We've dissected the film's narrative, speculated on potential responses from Hollywood's elite, and encouraged viewers to form their own opinions. As we sign off, we want to remind you to stay connected with us by hitting the subscribe button. You join our community and stay updated with the latest from Hollywood, but don't stop there. Make sure to activate notifications by hitting the bell icon, ensuring you're instantly notified whenever we release a new video. We appreciate your support and look forward to continuing this cinematic journey with you. Stay tuned for more engaging content, insightful analysis, and thought-provoking discussions on the world of cinema. Remember, in a world full of information, staying informed and critical is key. So until our next video, stay safe, stay curious, and keep asking questions. That's all for today, folks. Until next time.